Good morning, good morning. It's another fine Saturday morning here on Your Breakfast Lifestyle with Your Snack Society. Once again, hello, I hope you're doing good. It's Rise and Shine Breakfast Time. I'm the Eola Mahoney here with Mr. Brandon. <sighs> good morning. You need to wake up, man, because we got breaking news here. But I'm excited about this one. Uh-oh, what's going on? I'm way excited about this one because I've been waiting for this since first the word leaked out these were coming, and now they're here. We got them both. The Girl Scout cookie breakfast cereal, Thin Mint action, and not, I'm not calling them Samoas, though, but they're Caramel Crunch. Oh, okay. Yes, sir. Well, I think it was back in around November or December, word got out that this was going to be coming as a big item this mm -hmm. uh, winter, and here it is. Looking all over them, they finally see them hit Target and are out and about, and we're going to try them both. Knock them out one episode here of The Breakfast Lifestyle, baby. Looks like General Mills is responsible for this. Aha. Uh -huh. The Thin Mints just look like uh, flattened uh, cocoa puffs from what I can tell. Yeah. Yeah, and then what we got over there. The, the caramel, caramel Crunch are circular. You know what they kind of remind me of in color? They remind me of those damn um, Captain Crunch. The donuts? The donuts we did. Yeah. yeah. They, Appearance-wise, they look like that. I don't mm -hmm. think they'll be like that, but they're definitely doing the, the circle deal to match the uh, the shape of the uh, the cookies. And they don't mention oh, yeah. coconut. Nope. Probably been too expensive to do coconut. Yeah. Or who knows how that would work with like the milk yeah, involved yeah, and all that. Who knows. That might have been an odd, an odd scenario there. Somebody might be keeping them out of the equation. But we're gonna find out. We're gonna crack these boxes open, get a good look at them, and give them a taste right here this morning. Grab a bowl, baby. It's cartoon time with your snack society. Yeah. Got them both here. We got our box of thin mints. We got our box of caramel crunch. Which one should we check out first, my sir? Let's try out the Samoas first. All right. Let's see what's going on here and open these up. See what kind of scent we get. Like you said, they're Samoas, but they're not Samoas. Yokozuna on hand here to check them out for authenticity. Yeah. There we go. All right. First, I'm gonna get a little whiff in here. Ooh. Catch some of that. Mm, yeah, it actually does smell like coconut. So yeah, I think let's I see. Some action in there. there we go. Get a good look in there at that. One goes flying onto the floor. They're a good size. Yep. Give them that. Kind of plump. Yeah, yeah, they are. And yeah, it's definitely kind of. It's got that. It smells like the cookies. Yeah. It smells like the cookies. Yeah, definitely. Man, okay, I'm impressed there. Now let's open up these thin mints. Get a look at that. This is the one I'm personally more excited about of the two. I mean, when it comes to the Girl Scout cookies, for me personally, Thin Mints and the Tagalongs are like my absolute favorite. So unfortunately, there's not a Tagalong flavor, mm -hmm. which would have been amazing. Yeah, you know, chocolate Ooh. cereal wasn't a thing in my household. So I guess I just don't have the uh, overall experience of it very Ooh. much to want to have it. But, you know, it's cool. It's definitely not the most appealing looking thing, but the first thing I'm getting right off the bat, smell that. There is mint action oh, yeah, going on up in definitely. there. Definitely, that smells like a grass, grasshopper cookie, man. Yeah, I mean, appearance-wise, yeah. it's not that exciting looking, but it has the scent down, kind of like a mint chocolate chip scent going on there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, so far, appearance-wise, not bad. Uh, on, on to, to the eye, I got to go with the caramel crunch, but the taste—that's the big equation here. So I guess let's get some milk action involved, and then we'll dig in here to see them fully. Done up, all, right. all pretty. However, we want them to look. There you go. Get proper presentation there of the two bowls. A nice close look at your thin mint or caramel crunch. We're about to dig in. It's Saturday morning breakfast time, baby, on the Breakfast Lifestyle, and we'll be right back. All right, man. It's time to check it out. The Girl Scout cookie cereal is gonna live up to the months of hype. Let's see what's up and check out caramel crunch first. I'm thinking. Let's see how. The key here is it's caramel crunch. Is it going to have the crunch? I'm going to try the thin mint first. Mm. Ooh. I'll put that down there for you. Mmm. This is not that minty. Okay. That's no, the first I thing I know is it's got more of a corn thing going on. Mm. I don't know if the mic's picking it up, but that's definitely delivering on the crunch. Heavy on the crunch flavor. Let's see about thin mint here. Mmm. The um, okay, crunch-wise, having them back to back, it's about the same. Yeah. 
I wouldn't call those more crunchy, but what the one difference is, is the texture. Mm -hmm. The Thin Mint is delivering on that crumbly, grainy texture that the Thin Mint cookies have. Yep. It has that down really good. Um, Flavor-wise, though, there's a little bit of mint. There's a little bit of chocolate, but it's not hitting me over the head. No. That might be a good thing, because it might be kind of annoying if it did, but then again, I don't really feel it's like delivering on... Thin Mint. No, I, to me it's really muted. It's not uh, anything that's to write home about. It's mm -hmm. not that minty. It's not that chocolatey. In mm -hmm. fact, the very first thing I tasted was the grain composition of the cereal itself. It has that, it has that corn pop yeah. kind of taste. Yeah, I'm going to taste yeah. this right here real quick. Um, yeah. Now hmm. this, it's definitely sweeter. Um, mm -hmm. But I don't get any coconut flavor, even nope. though it had a little bit of that scent to it. It's not promising that, obviously, but yeah. you know, by showing that particular that one, yeah. by showing that cookie on it, you would think it would have some kind of coconut flavor. That's not really going on there. It's just basically got kind of a, a sugary thing. Yeah. Maybe almost like a dolce de leche or something like yeah. that. Yeah, I mean, both of it. It's not really caramel. It's not particularly crunchier than the other. But both of them, yeah, I would say the flavors are weak. Yeah. On both of them. Both of them need more oomph. Especially, I mean, if you're, you're talking about thin mint cereal, I mean, come on, I'm ready for like a punch of like chocolate flavor, and it's just really weak. Yeah. Um, so yeah, so both of them, I'd say underwhelming. Very much so. I'm, dare I say, disappointed pretty much. Uh, I do think I like the caramel crunch, is it what they're called? Yeah, yeah. A little bit better than the thin mint, because. I don't know, it just actually has more flavor. There's not much flavor going on in my mind with the Thin Mint at all. Yeah, yeah, of the two, I think I'm gonna agree with you. I was more excited for the Thin Mint, like I said earlier, Thin Mint and the Tagalongs are my favorite of the darn Girl Scout cookies, and the Samoas are okay, but these are like, yeah, I, I'm, I'm gonna go with that. I like those better than the Thin Mint, and, but both of them overall, they're weak on flavor, and I think the biggest thing the Thin Mint go, has going for them is they kind of have the texture right, yeah. but it doesn't have the flavor. Yeah. Of the two, I recommend the Caramel Crunch, but disappointing overall, especially after all the hypes, I think both of them kind of, I think I'll go two-thirds on the Caramel Crunch, and mm -hmm. I'm going to go half on the Thin Mint. I mean, mm -hmm. there's nothing overly bad about them, but they're just not exciting. They're not getting me excited to start the day. They're not getting me excited for Girl Scout cookies. Yeah, I'm going to absolutely agree with his assessment there. The rating is spot on. I was thinking that he might even give the 10 minutes of 5 eighths there, and I was going to go with the half, but no, we're going to agree on both. It's going to be a two-thirds for the Caramel Crunch and a half Oof. for the um, Thin Mint, and I think it's actually struggling to get to the half. Right? Yeah, no, it's... It, it's it's underwhelming as the key word for the whole thing, and but I think the potential's here. Mm -hmm. If General Mills and the Girl Scout Company next year want to bring these back, up the flavor, and you could be you could be up in that three quarter seven eighths range. Mm -hmm. It's just that's the key thing that's missing is flavor. Yes, excitement to start my day. Come on, it's Girl Scout cookie cereal. Yeah, it's supposed to taste like cookies. Back when we were kids, if, if the cereal was supposed to taste like a cookie, it tastes like a cookie. Yeah, like cookie crisp. Cookie. Yeah. Chris. Yeah, this this is all kinds of weird over the map like that, but tell us what you think. I want to get your take on this. These are just hitting the shelves or out there. I'm sure you're checking them out. Let us know. And there's tons of ways to do it. You can start in the comments down below. You can even do it where the whole darn thing started with the Snack Society on the Facebook group. That's right. Click on the link in the description down below to join us there on Facebook with hundreds of the coolest people in the world in our group, and you should be too. Why aren't you? Also, follow us on all the social medias including and especially the Twitter and Instagram at Brandon Rick SAS, at Hugh Mahoney, and at Brick in the SAS. Yes, and when you do, no matter where you are, when you're having breakfast, we want to know a couple things. Two hashtags. Hashtag Breakfast Lifestyle to tell us what you're enjoying for breakfast and what you think about this cereal. And hashtag Snack Society all day, every day for all your snacking needs. We're going to know all about the Girl Scout cookie cereal because you're going to tell us. If you think it's better than this, give us a scoop and let us know. Mm. That's right, and you want to like, comment, share, and subscribe. In the meantime, in between time, rise and shine. See you next time. Bye-bye.